Loving you came with heavier price. The price of bitter guilt, the shame that my heart failed to tame. A baseless pit beat in my belly composing of gruesome secrets that bruised my tongue, trapped between my teeth and sealed my lips with a potential truth that I would never whisper your name into the ears of anyone but to only my books. Mm. Okay. And that my books will have none open them except your gaze and the looks. Sometimes, sometimes, sometimes I, sometimes I wonder if you remember how we had each other. It was the tightest of hearts. It was the tightest of hearts. And the warmth of all of it all. When I think about it, I can't help but but sigh with a feel of the pressure of your breasts on my chest. When I feel how much we touched each other with an assurance of for better, for worse, till death do us apart, I feel terrible. But it hurts me that I can only whisper your name to my book. It hurts me that I can only whisper your name to this huge pile of books. And that my books will have none open them except you stay and look. Sometimes, sometimes I wonder how you felt when our lips met. Sometimes I wonder how you felt when we held hands. Sometimes I wonder how you felt when we were free to watch each other's nakedness. When we were free to study the contours of our bodies. When we were free to study the rift valleys. I'm speaking about valleys of our bodies or the protrudings. Sometimes I wonder if that ever made sense to you. You see, just a little peek into what I am saying. I am saying, I love you. Oh, I love the aroma on your body. Those tiny details that made me wonder and made the wonder doubt whether it was the magical works of this heart or it was the description with which I attached to your beauty. And it's only sometimes. And this very time, which is not some time, I am wondering if you can feel my lack of description of how I feel about you.